Hey YouTube, it's Patricia and this is Luna. Hi Luna. She's my little dog. Uh, we're just thinking about motivation. There's a difference between motivation and inspiration, right? And uh, my husband was talking about this with me and it was really great, Patrick was. Um, the difference is that motivation is something outside of you that drives you, right? The impotence to make you move. And inspiration is something inside of you that drives you and compels you to move. So a lot of people mot are motivated to work out because they're trying to lose weight. Um, they have an event coming up that's driving them. Uh, they have a trainer they have to meet, uh, like me or something like that, and they feel like they have to show up. Um, I don't know where you're going. Just chill out. Good puppy. Um, so they're very motivated at, at the time, right? But motivation is something that may or may not last. And I think when you get to the point where it becomes a lifestyle and you feel inspired and you have to work out or you don't feel well then that's a beautiful thing then you have inspiration even more than motivation uh i heard this put this way by patrick that um motivation is like you have a destination to get to and you look up uh directions on on whatever map you use map quest google apple whatever right ways um, look up one of those things and you get directions on how to get there step by step and you follow it and you turn when it tells you to turn and you do everything it tells you to do and that's like a motivation right it, it's it's telling you what to do inspiration is like you know how to get there you already have the path laid out in your head and you just drive and you can almost do it without thinking it's so automatic so if we get to the point where as long as it's actually uh laying down here if you get to the point where things are inspired if you're inspired to work out and if you don't go, you feel like you're missing something that day. That's a beautiful thing if you get to that point. Where if you don't eat healthy, you're, you're, you feel different. And you know that ins you have that inspiration that, you know, I want to feel good, so I'm going to eat healthy, right? That's the point that I really love getting my clients to where they're inspired. And then they don't even need me anymore. They're just going to work out because they know uh, that they need to and that they feel better when they do it. They know that if they eat healthy that they're going to uh, have a better appearance and a better feeling inside. So that's a great feeling. Um, I often do a 10 week program with them where I hope to get them from motivation to inspired. So they don't even need me anymore. That's a beautiful thing if they get there. Um, some people can, some people can't. Hopefully you can find whatever motivates you and you can find an inspiration from deep inside of why you take care of yourself. Luna, don't knock over the camera. Um, then that would be a good thing for you. I hope you get there. Uh, but whatever, wherever you are on your path, just go ahead and keep moving forward because as long as you don't give up, you haven't failed. Isn't that true? If we keep striving, if we keep going forward, we haven't failed. So that's where you want to think about it too is that you may have had problems in the past and it didn't turn out exactly where you want to. Maybe you've gained weight. Maybe you lost weight and gained it back. Who knows, right? There's a lot of different stories. But if you don't give up, you keep making progress, then you haven't failed. So stay the course. Don't fail. I don't give it up on yourself and uh, be easy on yourself you know if you don't do it perfectly don't worry about it if in the past you didn't do something right and it didn't work out the way you wanted to just uh, keep going forward the past only bothers us if we live there you know what I mean if you think about your uh, if you're driving a boat and there's a wake behind you like where you can see the water rippling behind you that's what the past is it's behind you it doesn't steer the boat right you steer the boat you steer your path forward and that's what you want you to think about too, is don't let the past trouble you. Just keep going forward. You can do it. I know you can. All right. Take care of yourselves. Have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.